Underneath the water's surface lies the home to some of the most bizarre-looking mutant fish imaginable. Oh, toy die tower away. With some of the ones you would come across looking like they belong more on a faraway planet than on Earth. Here are 15 mutant fish taking over waters around the world. Number 15. Mutant fish pulled from river. Extracted from the river's waters, the fisherman surely couldn't have imagined what he was gonna pull up in his net when he just went out on a seemingly regular day on the boat. What they caught, however, was anything but normal. The fish in question, which was pulled from the depths of the river, has a very long and sluggish looking body with peculiar looking fins scattered all along it. It looks like a rather magical creature with its hue of green on top, with the fisherman also being understandably impressed with his catch of the day as he holds the weighty fish in his slippery hands with a look of amazement glistening in his eyes. I don't blame him for being amazed, as I doubt he will ever catch a more unique fish again. With a picture to immortalize the moment and add evidence to his tale that he once caught himself a mutant fish, I'm sure this will be bragged about for many moons to come down by the local bar. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 14. Cyclops Albino Shark You would think a one-eyed fish would be the stuff of myth and legend. Never mind an albino one-eyed fish. I'm being deadly serious. In 2011, a commercial fishing crew off the coast of Baja, California, Sur Mexico hauled a dusky shark and pulled it on board. Everything seemed to be normal until the shark was cut open and its insides were exposed. When incisions were made, not only did they discover that the shark was pregnant, but that the fetus inside was not your regular baby shark. Albino and with one large eye in the center of the face, I can only imagine the shock the fishermen must have experienced. They must have thought their eyes were playing tricks on them. Of course, they had to grab a picture of this phenomenon, and unsurprisingly, the online community did not believe what they saw. Online bloggers claimed the photo wasn't real and was just a clever use of Photoshop. However, scientists intervened and confirmed that the Cyclops fish was real and actually had functioning optical tissue. Although the unusual fish was unlikely to have survived for long in the dark and dangerous world of the sea with only one eye. Number 13. Two-Headed Dolphin Regular dolphins are pretty fascinating creatures, never mind a two-headed one. On a beach in western Turkey, a mythical-looking creature was discovered washed up on the sand according to local media. The remains of a conjoined dolphin must have been a sight to behold when you were on a calm stroll along the seafront beach in Dekili near the Aegean city of Izmir. The startled discoverer was a gym teacher who was holidaying in the area. This is surely a holiday they won't be forgetting anytime soon, no matter how many therapy sessions they attend. The rarity of this sight is pretty obvious, but to really get the message across, listen to this. It is only the fifth known case of conjoined twins in the dolphin family and only the third known to have made it to the fetal stage of growth. Absolutely unbelievable stuff. Although, after stumbling across the bizarre remains, you would be forgiven for not feeling lucky. Number 12. Pugnose Striped Bass the pug dog breed is considered to be a favorite amongst many pet lovers, so it'll be interesting to see if people give this pug-nosed fish the same kind of love. Just when you start coming to terms with the fact that the ocean is filled with countless species of fish which we have yet to discover, you realize that the ones we already know about have the tendency to naturally mutate. Talk about constantly switching it up. Nicknamed the pug-nosed striped bass, they have been known to us humans for a couple of decades now, with the first sighting coming way back in 1960 by the outdoors writer Bill Burton who reported the unusual looking fish to the Baltimore Sun after catching one near Hart Miller Island. 
Burton reported in his writings at the time, growth in fish with this condition is reduced, as they may have difficulty passing water over the gills or seizing and holding prey. This forward jutting lower jaw mutation is usually not as pronounced as it is in this fish. Despite being so heavily mutated, rather bizarrely, this pug looking fish has been thriving and looks far from slowing down. So maybe this is one mutant fish which could seriously take over the world. Who knows, maybe one day owning one of these peculiar fish will be the latest trend. I'm just waiting for the Labrador fish to make itself known to the world. Number 11. Fish with horns. Fish are known for many things, from being great pets to admire and appreciate from a tank or pond, to making a great piece of omega-3 and protein on the dinner table. One thing they are certainly not known for is having a collection of dragon-like horns on their head. You can imagine the surprise when this Russian angler pulled a couple of fish out of the river or tish in Siberia and was left gawking at multiple protruding horns. I personally would have just slung them out of the boat straight away in the heat of the moment. Luckily, this fisherman didn't, and now we have photo evidence of the mutant fish which he claims is the result of pollution in the local area. The 25-year-old fisherman points toward falling debris from rockets as the culprit to the set of horns being mutated onto the fish. Falling debris from space rockets launched at Baikonur in Kazakhstan might be a valid reason, as who knows what kind of chemicals are being placed inside the engines of those machines. Whatever the case, how cool would it be to see a half-fish, half-dragon being? I'm just imagining a winged trout which can breathe fire now. Number 10. Two-mouthed Russian mutant fish. What is it with Russians and mutant fish? Fishermen in Russia must have had quite the shock when they pulled on board a fish which looks like no fish I've ever seen in my life. From the top, this looks like your regular fish you'd see at the local fishmongers. But it's when you look at its belly that the difference can really be seen. This nightmarish catch has two mouths, with one in the regular position and the other on the underside of its neck. Imagine the pace with which this slippery thing could wolf down its dinner. Having two mouths would be pretty cool. You could live in a constant state of eating whilst maintaining a conversation. Anyway, the double-mouthed features aren't the only thing weird about this mutant fish. The video of the catch also apparently shows a tail which bizarrely hooks around the bottom. And if that wasn't enough, how does a fleshy sack of translucent liquid sound? The fishermen think the sack could be full of eggs, so I say burn it with fire. Sorry, I just don't think a growing mutant fish species is what we really need right now. Number 9. Giant Fluorescent Blue Fish Imagine you're relaxing by a lake and you see a group of fish swim by, and then all of a sudden you spot a giant and fluorescent member amongst them. According to this stunning video footage shot at Gaston County Lake in North Carolina, United States, a brightly colored alien-looking fish can be seen swimming along the water's surface. The four-foot-long being is thought to weigh around 30 pounds, but why is it such a weird color? Did it eat something radioactive? Well, not quite. While you might think this is an impossibility, brightly colored fish are actually existent in the wild. The rainbow trout, for example, has a one in a million chance to be bright blue thanks to a rare genetic variant. Given that people are speculating the mysterious fish is a carp, the chance of it having this genetic variation is even rarer than one in a million. So no need to go calling the CIA and reporting an alien sighting then. I wonder what other fish think of the mutation of their friend. Do they think it looks cool? or is it ostracized from the group? Kind of like the fish version of Rudolph. Number 8. Giant Mutant Fish If I was going diving, the last thing I would want is for a giant, mutant, and aggressive fish to start taking violent bites in my direction. Locals in Siberia understandably got sick and tired of this gruesome-looking fish attacking everything that came anywhere near it. It wasn't the prettiest of fish to look at, to say the least. With a giant head, piranha-like teeth, and a strong tail the size of an oar, it's easy to see why so many locals were afraid of this fish, which looks like it had come straight from the depths of the underworld. Well, enough was enough. The fish had been a pain in the locals' necks for far too long. 
After a mighty effort, the fish was hunted and finally caught. The vicious looking thing thrashed about on the grass, taking swipes at anything that approached it in its typical angry nature. After closer inspection, the so called mutant fish turned out to be a regular wolf fish. While wolf fish are usually just endangered bottom feeder predators, this one's violent tendencies were enough for the nearby community to get rid of it. It just goes to show being nice goes a long way. If this wolf fish wasn't so pissed off all the time, it would probably still be alive today. Number 7. Fish with Human Teeth Imagine going to your dentist's waiting room only to look across the hall and seeing a fish waiting in line for their appointment with a newspaper in hand. This might sound like some bizarre imaginary world, but after what this school teacher caught when he was out fishing proves this could be a lot closer to reality than you would think. In the town of Kimindores in the West Papua region of the Southeast Asian country of Indonesia, this weird looking fish was caught and handed to pupil Ahmad Cesare. Ahmad was mind blown to discover that the regular looking catch had human like teeth inside of its mouth. <laughs> The fish's mouth was filled with molar-type gnashers, which look like they would usually be found in a human's mouth. Why would a fish have human-like teeth, except for smiling at the camera? Well, the teeth could have come about due to the fish's possible diet of nuts and other foods, which need grinding down before consuming. On the flip side, it could just be a mutant fish which has taken its next steps towards transforming into a human. I don't know, human-like teeth on a fish. What's next? Human hands and feet on a fish? And does the fish need to floss now? I have so many questions. Number 6. Ugly Thai Mutant Fish this is one ugly and grotesque fish. I know looks are subjective, but I mean seriously, ew. I would not advise having a look at this ghastly sight before having a meal, unless you want to be put right off. This Thai fisherman must have thought he was in a horror movie when he pulled this hideous being onto his boat. Pale, toothy, and writhing around the boat like a demon which has just escaped from a laboratory, I don't think this poor bugger is going to be winning any beauty contests anytime soon. It literally looks like it's just been hanging around waiting to be caught since the prehistoric times. Let's just hope for its sake that it has a really good personality. I know they say looks can kill, but I think this fish is just so off-putting, I don't doubt that it really could. It just goes to show how little we know about the fish world. Although it's hard to imagine there being many more fish swimming along the seabed with a more ugly and startling appearance. If a kid were to draw an ugly fish, it couldn't dream of one stranger looking than this one. Number 5. Bird-Headed Fish The characteristics of a typical fish are pretty simple. Scales, fins, gills, and of course, a bird-shaped head. I don't know what kind of funky waters this fish must have been swimming in to develop such bird-like features, but I would stay well clear of it if I was you. <laughs> this unusual creature was caught on video lying on the floor after being pulled from its watery home. The footage piqued the interest of those online, and the poor fish was made a viral sensation. This exposure was heightened by the Chinese newspaper, Guishu Urban Newspaper, who identified the fish as a common freshwater carp. This hasn't stopped people from speculating around the half-fish, half-bird animal. Imagine if it could fly. Now that would be some story. It would be hilariously dystopian if you looked out of your window one morning and saw a collection of flying fish munching on your bird feeder. I'm all here for the mutations. The weirder, the better. Although, whoever clearly spilt some radioactive chemicals into the ocean should really just own up. Number 4. Alien-looking fish if you reeled in an alien-looking monster, you would understandably be pretty shocked. So you can sympathize with this 19-year-old fisherman when he almost jumped out of his skin at the sight of his out-of-this-world catch. With huge eyes that look like fake googly eyes on top of the head, this is actually a ratfish. This sore sight owns the Latin name Chimeris monstrosa Linnaeus. Nailed it, I hope. Which is derived from a Greek mythical monster that had the equally bizarre appearance of having a head of a lion and the tail of a dragon. The huge protruding eyes that grossly decorate the beast from below actually have a practical use, aside from scaring fishermen. The eyes are believed to have been developed to help them see when at the dark depths of the ocean they reside in. 
If you're wondering why you don't see these weird but fascinating mutant fish in the same consistency as codfish, it's mainly due to their rarity and the fact they spend their days swimming along the darkest depths of the ocean's floor 800 meters down. These fish have been around for a long while, 300 million years to say the least. Thankfully, they don't fancy the taste of human flesh as they prefer crabs and sea snails. Number 3. Giant Mutated Norwegian Fish When this Norwegian fisherman went out one day to try and catch some fish, he was obviously hoping for a big catch. However, I doubt he was expecting to reel in this world record breaking fish. This cod pulled in from the Barents Sea weighed an astonishing 60 kilograms, which is 8 kilograms more than the world record. They must have been pulling for their life, with their equipment apparently almost breaking at one point, as you can imagine. While it might be massive, it was certainly no pretty sight, with the fish having a mutated outline which is all too familiar in these parts. Well, you could put it down to just one of nature's freak mishaps, apologies fish, it actually has a sinister reason behind it. Norway refuses to sign the international agreements in the field of environmental protection and continues to throw mining production waste into the barren sea. With all of those chemicals being left to seep out into the marine life, it's no wonder they're getting some funky fish coming in on their cast line. Number 2. Australian Two-Mouthed Fish Everyone knows that Australia is full of the wildest and most extreme animals on the planet. Literally everything will try and eat you. But whilst their crocodiles and spiders are no doubt terrifying, imagine the shock when a fisherman in the southern part of the country hauled a fish with two mouths out of a lake. Gary Warwick was the lucky person to have to be face to face with a two-mouthed fish when he reeled in his line from a regular day of fishing at Lake Bonnie in southern Australia. While some radioactive spillage would be cool and certainly a cinematic reasoning behind the weird appearance, it's probably just down to a condition called diprosomia which is a genetic mutation where something has more than one particular facial feature, in this case, the mouth. The mouth was made existent thanks to the gill arches not being connected to its mouth. While the mouths are connected, the bottom mouth remains open, with the fish seemingly unable to close it. After 30 years as a commercial fisherman, Gary says he's never seen anything like this before. I guess I'd be more alarmed if he was very casual with the news. Sadly, for our fishy friend, they don't survive for long in the wild. The facial deformity usually means that something else on the inside isn't quite right either, which results in complications with internal organs and digestion. I guess being caught on the end of a fishing rod doesn't exactly help with living a long life either. Number 1. Komodo Dragon Fish When you mix armored scales which look like they belong on an alligator, the fin of a regular fish, and the head of a Komodo dragon, you get quite the result. Casually jogging along the coast at Island Beach State Park in New Jersey, Stephanie Hall retreated further inland to get away from some seals by the water. Although, she ended up stumbling into the path of a prehistoric fish which lay dead on the sand. She must have had the fright of her life. I know I would have. Dating all the way back to prehistoric times, the Atlantic sturgeon was actually a popular resident in the Delaware Bay Area thanks to its countless supply of eggs feeding the thriving caviar industry in the local area. The local area was even known as the caviar capital of America, with a local town even being named Caviar. So if you're wealthy and enjoy this delicacy, then you have this startling prehistoric fish to thank for filling your plate. Although you'll be forgiven for still finding this mix and match fish hideous. It literally looks like a crossbreeding experiment gone wrong. With all of these mutant fish swimming about in our waters, it really does make you second guess wanting to go for a dip in the sea. If you could create a mutant fish, what features would you give it? Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!